hi guys mrs brajas here with another origami project um if you were with me for the last project we did an origami heart uh definitely a beginner project this next project is also a beginner project a little bit harder than the heart but still uh simple enough uh it's an origami butterfly so i've got uh, printed paper here which makes it a little more fun um, but you can use any paper it just has to be in the shape of a square so I've got just that a square sheet of paper um, I'm going to do it facing you so you want to have your blank side facing you um, I'm going to flip it in the shape of a diamond I'm going to take this point to this point and I'm going to fold it in half and you want to remember that when you're folding you want to line it up and then I'm even going to go a second time over that crease I just created. I'm going to open it up from there. Now I'm going to, I've got one line going through. I want a line going through the other way. So I'm going to take this point and fold it down again. And then I'm going to re-crease that to make sure it's nice and shaped for me. So when you open it up, you have um, two lines going through. Now I'm going to turn it so it's the shape of a square and I'm going to fold it in half. Okay, so when I open it, I now have the X going through and I've got one line going down the middle. I want one more line going this way, so I'm going to fold it in half again. All of those folds were to help us on the next step. So when you open it up, you should see the X going through and you should see a plus going through. You wanna hold it in the shape of a square still. And what we're gonna do is, I'll put my fingers, you're gonna take these two um, pieces that I have and you're gonna fold those together. Um, when you do that, I'm gonna turn. So I'm taking this side, this side, I'm gonna pinch those together and I'm gonna kinda hold, hold there, pinch together. And then it's gonna flatten in the shape of a triangle. So I've got this shape right now. And then if I pinch it close, it flattens right into a triangle. So I'll show you that again. I took this side and this side and I pushed them together. I just kind of pinch them. And then if you look, uh, you'll see that it will just pop right down into a triangle. Okay, so I've got my triangle. From there, I am going to I think about this I want the yep I'm sorry <laughs> I want the the top of the triangle up I had to think about that one for a second I want the top of the triangle up and you've got a crease line in the center and what you're going to do is you're going to take one layer of this so you've got all those flaps down you're going to take just one layer you're not going to fold it to the line um you're going to fold it just a little off off of that center and then pinch it into place so my center line is here I did not fold it to that center I went off you're gonna do the same thing to the other side and you want to do it about the same distance so about the distance I have there I'm gonna try to match that on this side just one layer okay so to me it kind of looks like a tulip like here are petals it looks like a tulip to me from there, you're going to flip it this way. Okay, so now we have the bottom of the triangle up. This, this. You're going to take, you've got your two little, what I call them, petals there. You're actually going to take the bottom part and you're going to fold it back. So I'm going to take this bottom, I'm going to fold it back, and I'm going to eventually see it up top here. I'm not going to fold it. I'm just going, I'm going to fold it back, but I'm not going to press it into place. I'm just going to hold it. So again, I took this bottom and I'm just folding it back. So you'll see it coming up on that other side. And then I'm gonna just hold there with my finger. You can see the butterfly shape starting to form. I'm gonna hold there with my finger. I'm gonna now take this and I'm gonna fold it over to help it stay in place. So again, that, that was up and I'm folding it over. It's not done yet because it won't stay together. You see it's still, still kind of coming apart. So then I'm gonna pinch where I have that little piece. And from there, I'm just gonna turn it. I'm gonna fold it up. So you want the wings to fold up and then you are gonna pinch that into place and you have your origami butterfly. 
So a couple more steps than the heart, but still definitely manageable for a um, beginner origami project. All right, thanks.